Hi everyone, my name is Alex Sear. I'm the author of new running book, Runners of the Niche. You can find it at runnersofthenish.com. Um, as people may know, running and writing are two big parts of my life. Um, so today I'll break down my top five favorite running books. Number five is Life Outside the Oval Office by Nick Simmons. Just a guy who thinks really outside the box. It's an awesome autobiography. And if you're looking for a bit of motivation to be an active speaker in your sport, that's the one to read. Number four for me is The Animal Keepers by Don Benke. Benke is the coach of a high school team and he tells the story of their journey to the state championship. And fun fact, um, the guy who writes the foreword in the book is high school alumnus um, Chris Solinsky. So if you're a big, big, big Solinsky fan, make sure to read that book. Number three for me is Once a Runner. It's become kind of a cult classic and if uh, you're a runner looking for a bit of an existential thrill and you're really into the high performance um, and just culture of the sport, uh, follow Quentin Cassidy's journey. John L. Parker writes the book and it's excellent. Number two for me is Endure by Alex Hutchinson. Now, calling it just a running book I don't think does it justice because it's really just an exploration in human performance and the maximization of the mind. Um, and with Elliot Kipchoge just killing it and breaking records, uh, the book becomes more and more relevant and interesting. A good read for any sports fan, I would say. So my number one, and it's not going to come as a surprise to any of you who have read Runners of the Niche, because Runners of the Niche uh, holds a lot of same structural elements as this book. It's Running with the Buffaloes by Chris Lear. It's the story, the day-to-day -day telling of the Colorado Buffaloes in 1998. It's an awesome story. Um, make sure that if you read it before a season, don't read it too fast because you'll either win your conference championship or you're going to get injured. I've experienced both. Uh, extremely motivational and I do recommend it.